What's up beautiful people, it's Cindy Apollo, welcome to the channel. Today we're going to be checking this video and it's titled Meet the most liberal country in the world. Interesting. I'm excited to check this one out to hear what I've got to say. Let's check it out. Welcome to Fascinating Netherlands a country that blends rich history, incredible culture, and breathtaking landscapes. Located in northwestern Europe and bordered by Germany and Belgium, the Netherlands is known for its liberal policies and progressive approach to social issues. Additionally, its famous red light district located in the capital Amsterdam is also something many are familiar with. Its beautiful tulip fields and imposing windmills also play a crucial role in Dutch history and identity bringing beauty and fascination. With a population of approximately 18 million people living in a compact area of 41,000 square kilometers, the Netherlands is a captivating destination that offers a variety of unique experiences to explore. Mm, it's so beautiful. The history of the Netherlands dates back to prehistoric times, with Germanic and Celtic tribes settling in the region. However, it was during the Middle Ages that this nation began to emerge as a distinctive political and cultural entity, driven by maritime trade and the textile industry. This period of economic ascent coincided with a turbulent period of religious and political conflict. The Netherlands was the stage for the Dutch revolt against Spanish rule, which lasted for several decades and culminated in the country's independence in 1648, recognized by the Treaty of Westphalia. The 17th century was marked by the Dutch Golden Age, highlighted by cultural and scientific flourishing. Decline came in the 18th century with the French invasion and the subsequent establishment of the Kingdom of the Netherlands under Napoleon. After Napoleon's fall, the Netherlands became an independent kingdom in 1815. The 20th century brought challenges with the world wars, but the Netherlands emerged as a prosperous and tolerant democracy. Today, it is recognized as a modern and progressive nation with a historical legacy that continues to inspire the world. One of these inspirations is Vincent van Gogh, one of the most important and renowned painters of all time. His contribution to modern art is unparalleled with his unique and expressive style that transcended his time and influenced generations of artists. Van Gogh not only left a lasting impact on the history of art, but also enriched Dutch and global culture with his unparalleled masterpieces. He's beautiful. Do you know why the Netherlands has this name? This name was given to the country as a tribute to the flat and low topography of the region, which has 26% of its territory below sea level. Due to the difficulties mm. posed by excess water, the Dutch had to devise a way to drain all the water and ensure the habitability of these fertile lands. Thus, over the centuries, they developed a clever and effective water management system consisting of dikes, canals, and, of course, the iconic windmills. These structures... This is so beautiful. Oh my God. Looking at this, is just like... <sighs> Someone should just leave there. What? This is so pretty. Let's continue. These structures not only pumped water out of the lowlands, but also became symbols of Dutch ingenuity and the constant struggle against the forces of nature. When visiting the Netherlands, it is impossible not to marvel at the landscape dotted with windmills, a tangible reminder of the history and resilience of this extraordinary country. Another aspect that enhances the Dutch landscapes is the tulip fields. These colorful and vibrant flowers turn the fields into true multicolored carpets, creating an unparalleled visual spectacle. Originating from Central Asia, tulips were brought to the Netherlands in the 16th century and have since become an iconic oh symbol God. of the country. Spring is the time when the tulip fields bloom in all their splendor, oh, attracting thousands oh, of visitors from around the world to witness this marvel of nature. The fields stretch as far as the eye can see in an explosion of colors that seems hand painted. Strolling what? among these fields is a unique experience where it's one can feel indeed. the energy and vivacity oh that tulips God. bring to the Dutch scenery. 
And if you want to explore an incredible place in the oh, Netherlands, so you can't miss the opportunity to visit Vakanti Park Waterstadi. Located in the charming village of Ossenzijl, this residential complex offers a unique experience of living in harmony unique with indeed. nature. Situated in the heart of the stunning Vierribben Weeden Lake region, Waterstata Ossenzijl provides breathtaking panoramic views and an atmosphere Beautiful of tranquility and serenity. With its spacious and luxurious residences, many of which offer direct access to the surrounding canals and green areas, this is the ideal location for those seeking a life surrounded by natural beauty. Additionally, residents have access to a variety of modern amenities, ensuring comfort and convenience in a breathtaking environment. Yeah, Waterstate Ossensigil is more than just a place to live. It's a destination where you can deeply connect with nature and enjoy everything that countryside living has to offer. Now, speaking of Amsterdam, as you stroll through the Dutch capital, you can't help but notice the beauty that permeates the place. You can't. The streets are filled with a vibrant aura that captivates visitors, showcasing a variety of beautiful and picturesque spots that reflect Amsterdam's rich history and unique atmosphere. Rich. One of the city's most iconic features is the Canal Ring, a system of canals mm. that stretches over 100 kilometers, forming a stunning and romantic landscape. Taking a boat ride along the canals is an unforgettable experience, allowing mm. visitors to admire the elegant 17th and 18th century houses with their ornate facades and charming bridges. Oh, God, Another highlight gorgeous. of Amsterdam is the Vondel Park, a green oasis in the heart of the city. This beautiful park offers a peaceful retreat from the urban hustle and bustle, with serene lakes, spacious lawns, and wooded trails, perfect for a leisurely stroll or a sunny picnic. Yeah. Additionally, Amsterdam is known for its unique and eclectic architecture, which harmoniously blends historic buildings with modern and innovative designs. Visitors blends historic and modern building. This is gorgeous, this is beauty, this is what I love to see. Oh my god! Netherlands is a beauty. Amsterdam is beautiful. What? All of this gorgeousness from the lawns, the plants. Oh my god. How can you be in this place? And oh my god. The beauty, the nature, the view. It's excellent. It's everything I love to see. Let's go on. Designs. Visitors can admire architectural wonders such as the Royal oh, Palace, so the Anne what? Frank House, and the iconic Skinny Bridge. And speaking of wonders, we have Dutch okay. cuisine. One of the most iconic dishes of the Netherlands oh. is Stampot, a kind of mashed potatoes mixed with greens such as kale, spinach, or sauerkraut. Okay. This preparation, which can be accompanied by sausages, bacon, or roast meat, is considered a classic of Dutch mm. cuisine, especially in the colder months. Really? Another highlight is bitterballen, delicious fried balls of minced meat and sauce, <gasps> which are served as a oh, snack so or appetizer. What? This delicacy is often found in bars and oh cafes, accompanied by a cold beer. Cold beer? In addition to savory dishes, the Netherlands also stands out for its traditional oh, desserts, Jesus such as puffer cheese, I would small sweet pancakes day. sprinkled with powdered sugar, and oliebollen, oh. fried dumplings filled with dried fruits what? and raisins. By savoring this delicious and authentic cuisine, tourists oh. have the opportunity to connect with the essence of local culture, enjoying a sensory oh. experience oh, that evokes the traditions and identity of this country. But if you're looking for some more adult fun, you should head to the famous Red Light District. Red Light District. As a liberal country, the Netherlands reflects these values in its nightlife. Here, women enjoy total freedom to choose their clothing and behavior without fear of judgment. Aww. Situated in the heart of Amsterdam, this iconic neighborhood is known for its vast array of adult oh. entertainment. Here, illuminated windows showcase a variety of establishments from traditional brothels to coffee shops, offering a unique selection of products. Visitors can explore the narrow, bustling streets of the neighborhood, where they'll find a vibrant atmosphere and a myriad of options, options. for adults. Mm, With a mix of cafes, bars, and clubs, 
The Red Light District offers a unique and provocative experience for those looking to dive into Amsterdam's nightlife. But don't think the excitement only happens after dark. Imagine yourself walking down these streets during the day, and out of nowhere, a woman in intimate clothing appears calling you to come inside. What would you do? If you're interested in getting to know the Netherlands, or even living there, it's important to know about issues like the minimum wage. Okay, before we go on, go on. If are you from Netherlands? Are you from the Netherlands, or you live there, or you know about this? Um, what was your experience as a guy, or let's say a man or a woman? What was your experience? Have you had visited this place before, and you've had an experience where someone someone approached you or something? I would really love you to share your experience or other places. Are there other places that are similar uh, like this in the Netherlands or in Amsterdam? I would really love you to share that. But this nightlife here is beautiful. It's just giving a community. It's giving like a community, but it's beautiful. Oh my God. Beautiful to see. Let's go on. Issues like the minimum wage, rent, and food expenses. Starting with the minimum wage, the Netherlands has one of the highest values in Europe, mm. currently around $2,300 per month. Wow. This salary level, adjusted annually, aims to ensure a decent standard of living for the Dutch population. However, the high cost of living in the Netherlands is also a factor to consider. Mm. Especially in major cities like the capital, Amsterdam, rents can represent a significant portion of the monthly budget. A one-bedroom apartment in a central area of the city can cost between $900 to $1,500 per month, really? depending on the location. Mm -hmm. In other regions of the Netherlands, rents tend to be more affordable, ranging from $600 to $900 per month mm -hmm. for a one-bedroom apartment. One bedroom? This difference reflects the economic contrast between metropolitan areas and smaller cities. Oh. In terms of food expenses, the Netherlands has a relatively high cost of living mm -hmm. compared to other European countries. Mm -hmm. It's common to find meals in popular restaurants for about $15 to $25, while purchasing basic items in supermarkets can also be more expensive. This reality of the cost of living in the Netherlands, with a relatively high minimum wage, but accompanied by high housing and food costs, poses a challenge for the local population. Another aspect that influences the income of the Dutch is taxes. If you earn up to $75,000 per year living in the Netherlands, you'll have to allocate 37% of your salary to pay the government. <gasps> However, the country is recognized for its quality of life and the social benefits offered to citizens, such as health care and social security. Another aspect worth mentioning when discussing the Netherlands is the women of the country. They are typically tall and slender, uh, with a natural and radiant beauty wow. that reflects their health and active lifestyle. <laughs> Their facial features tend to be marked by a gentle harmony with often clear and expressive eyes that reflect the sunlight characteristic of the Dutch climate. With hair usually blonde, light brown or red, Dutch women exhibit a variety of tones that complement their clear and healthy complexion. Their hair is often worn in a simple and practical manner, reflecting the uncomplicated and functional mindset that is a hallmark of Dutch culture. Additionally, Dutch women tend to take good care of themselves, valuing healthy eating and regular exercise. This is reflected in their slender and toned figures, which are often the result of a combination of outdoor activities such as cycling and water sports, with a balanced approach to life. I hope you enjoyed this tour of incredible I Holland. did. If you liked this video, don't forget to subscribe to our channel and leave your like. Click on the video that's appearing on your screen now. I'm sure you'll enjoy the content. See you in the next video. Beautiful. I love how happy they are. They were just waving. It was, it's just beautiful to see. Oh my God. Yo. This is everything gorgeous I love to see. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Let me know if you are from... Um, Nether from the Netherlands. What other interesting things or interesting facts about Netherlands that um, you love and you love people to know about? Or if you're a tourist yourself, um, let me know what experience you had visiting the Netherlands. Um, because sometimes some people share their experience and it's not the exact same with others who visit because people experience 
the city or the country or the town different differently from how others do let me know what you think about this or what this is indeed beautiful the scene everything is gorgeous to see let me know your thoughts in the comment down below i'm sure tons of people have interesting things to share i really love your honest contribution you can share the useful information you think might be really helpful make sure to like comment and subscribe and all of that stuff and until next time see you in the next video